Hey, it's me, they, 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 and today we are going to be doing a video, and I'm going to be showing off how to use World Edit to be building a house. We're going to be making a very simple oak house, but you can use this with any other block. We have some spruce for some extra details. As you can see, this is a slow build I'm going to be working on. Uh, it'll, it'll be, you know, finished sometime. I might show it off on my channel. Who knows? If you want to see that, maybe like the video. I don't know. Maybe subscribe. You know, you don't have to, but if you want to, I would highly recommend it. So why don't we just get started? First of all, you want to install World Edit. It's just a mod, super simple. Just drop it in your mods folder. I'll put a link in the description for a video that will tell you how to download and install mods. Second, we want to go to chat slash slash, and we want, I believe it is the wand command. And we have the special wooden axe wand. So we can click, left click to set the first position. Just click on the block like that. And then right click to set the second position. And for the first command, we can do slash slash, and we can do set. And we can type in any any block we want. Like say we want, uh, I don't know, oak, oak planks, right? Put it in, and boom, we have this little thing of oak planks. And if you don't want that, you can do slash slash undo, which will do the last undo the last thing you just did. Or you can do slash slash redo and redo that. But we want to undo that. So now let's get started with actually building. Okay, so for bigger builds, you probably want to plan out like a floor plan so you don't accidentally do what I did and mess up where you have certain walls being bigger than other parts. But for a smaller scale build like this house we're going to build, you can just jump right into building it. But for a little demonstration, we'll go block here. We'll go one, two, three, and we'll put a block here. One, two, three, we'll put a block here. And one, two, three, put a block there. And that's going to be our little uh, area section for the pillars that will be building up the walls or something like that. Now, we'll do here and here. We'll build this one up a little bit. And we can go like that and like that. I'm just right clicking or left clicking and right clicking to set the positions. You can also, if you want to, type slash slash pause one or pause two to change the position. And we'll go slash slash set. Oops. Just set planks there we go and pop that in now i have some oak planks for the first wall and we can go over and we'll make the second wall come down to maybe sit here just pop in the same command i'm pressing the up arrow button so you can get the command and just keep pressing that to go all the way back we'll grab here and we'll go all the way over to there boop oops so you want to make sure that you actually do the right blocks. And just for sake of some extra shape, we'll just go out a little further, actually. Just like that. And we'll go... Oops. Yeah, you can't actually break blocks with this. We'll go there to there. Boop. And then we'll go there to... There. Boop. And there, two, of course, here. And now we have walls. Also, if you are um, a bit lazy, or you know, if you don't want to actually do that, you can do first position and second position. You can do slash slash walls, um, oak planks, and that you can't. You didn't see what that does. Uh, here, let's just do it over here, for example. But there. there to there and there you go you have walls which is a much better thing for me to do oops we'll go slash slash undo and we'll undo that just have to break this okay now let's get on to the uh rest of it okay so i just went ahead and added these pillars and a little connecting supports to them pretty just just simple boring things and you can see this right here is why you want to plan out your builds because this is smaller than the other sides same thing happened on uh, back here with these, but I was able to fix it. But you don't. You, you want to make sure that you know what you're doing first. Find out your builds. Use wool or something, and uh, don't be like me and uh, mess up. So, um, in each of these, I'm gonna put little windows. We'll just go boop boop like that, just to mark out where the windows will go like that. That is, of course, where the door will be. 
But before we do that, I want to get the roof done. I'll probably just punch out these holes for the windows. There we go. Um, just two tall windows will work if you want to make longer or <coughs> taller windows. Like here we can do that because, again, messed up a little bit. But you can just make a bigger window. Or you can make them all the same. Who cares? It doesn't matter. Just do whatever you want to. And there we go. So this one actually kind of looks intentional because, you know, but... It's not. Um, so you could add a second level. I'm not going to do that for this one, but you can kind of see what I would do here is make it choose a different block, go out a block. But we're not going to do that for this build. We're just going to go straight on to the roof, which we can do pretty easily, I think, if we just go from here up to, I don't know, like, maybe. Let's see. Um, and we want to go here and then I've actually never used it before but if you go um pause one and pause two do slash slash line oak planks okay that did not work as intended so what we probably want to do is go up a few blocks and by a few blocks I need one block do that same command there we go that worked kind of I guess Okay, so what we're going to want to do after we've gotten that selection, we'll look this way and we'll do slash slash stack, and we'll go 7 maybe, and you can see that was not quite enough, so we'll go 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, so we'll go 11, just like that, and now we have, well, okay, yeah, that's, that's a bit of a problem there, uh, but, okay, Probably wanted to put a mask on that, but that's fine. That's fine. Mask pretty much just makes it so it doesn't change a block, or so it only move a specific block. We could just do that. Okay. Whoops. Um, that was a mistake. But we also want to bring it out this way a little bit. I think if we just like do this, same thing. We'll go two, and we can do. Mask. No, I don't think we can, so let's try to do that. Um, probably, uh, um, okay. So, do this, connect that up, like so. Break this pillar here, and we can probably just fill in here, too. If we just go, like, here to here, maybe like to here, we'll go slash slash set oak. Planks, and we'll go from here to here. Same command. We'll go over to the back. We'll go here to here. Boop. Let me show you. Oh. We don't want make. We want to make sure that doesn't happen. And then we'll go from here to here. Same command. Oops, messed that up there. Now we can take the entire roof section here, we'll just grab from there to there, and we'll go, um, we'll stand right here, and we'll do slash slash copy. Then we'll go slash slash flip, and then slash slash paste. And as you can see, we have just successfully made a roof. It looked lopsided for a second, but I don't think it is. And we're going to put this part in here. Oops. And add that there. That actually looks cool, like having that support over there, but I might change that. And now for this, we're just going to do a similar thing, but we're going to make it go this way instead of that way. Okay, so I just added this roof on here and covered up that in there. And it is pretty simple, um, but... That is how you can easily make roofs. I'm going to change this right here from a uh, oak planks to be oak logs here. And we can do like this maybe to put like cool supports. That looks pretty cool. And we'll just do the same thing on the other side just for some continuity. And some symmetry. I'm not sure why it was so hard for me to say that. But symmetry. And we'll go like that. No, not like that. But we will go like this and that and that and that. Ah, okay. Right. Okay, there we go. I don't really like how that looks, but anyways. 
Now for the interior, I'm not going to do much. It looks actually really ugly in here. But what we will do is we'll just go over. Um, we'll just put a door here. We'll go over there, and we'll go over here. Boop, and we'll do go slash slash set. Oh. Planks, and there we go. We have the oak plank ceiling in, and to get rid of all this grass, we'll just go there. Uh, we, can, we can probably honestly just go all the way over here. And we'll go slash slash set. Um, we'll just go stone. We'll go stone bricks actually. Move over from here to here. Same command. Just T up there, enter. And just like that, we have a decent house. Actually, no, we don't have a house yet. Um, what you would probably want to do also is add a little bit of an edge trimming thing. Actually, that's why I have a spruce. So add a little edge trimming on this part here, like going up like that kind of. This probably will also change the um, main block on the side, but you can do something like that. And we'll put this on the top here. And we'll go around on this side as well. Make sure you don't place them upside down. If you do not mean to, then we'll go across the side here with spruce stairs. would probably work just fine here. So we'll go across like that. And it looks okay. You can probably do better th than this. Um, but I think it looks fine for now. We just do that. And then over here, oop, we'll go this. Then we'll go across the bottom here. Let's see how we're gonna make this work. Um, probably go well, something like that, I guess. That kind of works, I guess. Um, and then we'll go this side as well. Why are you like that? I don't want that. Okay. Like that. Boop, 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 boop. Go across this way. Again, could have planned it a little better. Should have planned it a little better. But we can do a little something like that on the end. That actually looks pretty nice. We go boop and a boop. Boop, and we'll just go across here as well. Just to make it look nice. Do that. This is just little details. Boop, forgot to put that there. And I'll just add some finishing touches, and I will see you after this transition. Okay, so I just added a bunch of details to this. We've got little flower beds there. Um, I added these little, like, support beam-looking things, and a door, and a little, like, pathway type thing with the, the cyan wool. I also had a little chimney here. I did little fancy, like, overhang things, and added little lights to them. Uh, I switched these up. I couldn't, I, I couldn't find a really good way to make them, like, you know, like supporting it, but I think this looks pretty decent. This here is kind of weird, um, just ignore that. And I made a little bit of an interior. I didn't go too much because, yeah, it's not much in here. A little like, furnace area, little beams with lights on it. Probably should have made it like one block taller because you can kind of like hit your head in there. And then a little kitchen here, a little like a fridge, uh, sink and cooker thing. There's like a thing that like, takes out the smoke a little bit. Probably do that look better. There we go. So yeah, that was the world edit tutorial. Basics, I guess. Um, you can pretty much use those principles to make any house or any build really. And you can look into slash slash. Look at all these. I mean, look at look at. So there's so many um, commands in here that I just won't be able to get to in this video, or probably any other videos for that matter. But those are the basics that you can use to make a lovely little house like this. I would recommend you don't follow everything block for block. That's why I didn't really show much of the decorating, but you could totally take this as inspiration or, you know, just... I mean, you could copy the whole thing if you wanted to. Um, but yeah, I'm giving plenty of views of it. Also, uh, don't, don't, don't look in the, the attic because um, 
It's kind of separated, but yeah, it's not that nice. I actually could probably do something up here if I wanted to, but I don't. Um, yeah, that's kind of awkward too. So, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to, and also like. See you later.